It was such a unique script. I mean, it mm. came across, it's an impossible log line to pitch. Um, yeah. You know, so it really, the script really spoke for itself. I mean, it, it had so many, so much of Taika in there, this kind of just unique balance of, 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 absurdity and and then also such a poignancy um you know he he's has he's so sensitive and and whimsical and childlike in a lot of ways and then he's also like this deep old soul um and all of that came across in that in his writing and you know even though it was a story that was very difficult to pitch because it sounded you know so out there when you read the script you really got a scent you knew that it was going to work because it, it was coming from Taika's voice. I'm not gonna lie I was a little bit intimidated because I was from just because you know I've admired her work for a really long time and um but she's full of so much kindness and generosity and I think the entire crew and everyone on set really felt really felt that felt that you were professional and you weren't, you know, obsessed with the whole idea that you've done, done so much in your life and achieved so much, but you're still a human being. Um, so, yeah, no, it's such a, such a pleasure, so thank you. <laughs> and that I, I could say exactly the same thing. There was, you're always so present and, and um, open and, and, yeah, generous, I think. It was fun and it was playful and I didn't, I felt like, I felt encouraged and I felt <clears throat> like I didn't really have to prove anything and that it wasn't kind of work and I felt safe, which was very nice. Your character was very suspicious of my character yeah, no. throughout the movie, so I'd get a lot of, like, mm. side-eye yeah. from Roman all the time. Like, uh, he never quite my, trusted my. what I was saying. So I just, what, it's really easy to basically just pull down your eyebrows like that. Mm. What's so beautiful about seeing this movie with an audience is you get to experience the kind of slapstick humor and everybody just... I think being surprised by how funny the film is and um, and light and absurd in moments. And then, you know, you get hit with the reality of what's going on in these really poignant, powerful, quiet moments because there's, like, all this noise and craziness going on. And then it's just, like, you know, you kind of get jerked into, like, the you, you feel the stakes of what these characters are experiencing. And um, it's incredibly powerful. You know, it's a. I think Taika uses humor in a way um, to kind of invite the audience in, um, and then you know, once he has you held captive, he he uses that uh, opportunity to really um, deliver a, a very powerful message. And um, you know, it's uh, it it was really uh, transformative to see the film with an audience because you get to see that that play back and forth. It's so important to accept people for who they are and not to to put them down or to d discriminate just because they're different from you. The, yeah, the idea of acceptance, um, yeah. And, yeah, <clears throat> and kind of reminded that kind of children's minds are fragile and mm. everything you say, it's gonna, it, it kind of, it doesn't, it goes far in a way and how Every hateful thing, it's gonna, it's a lot powerful than you actually think it is. Mm.